Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sagar Pajapati and in this video we gonna see customer who never order problem in lead code. Okay. So as I told you before in the previous videos that I will be solving or I will be giving a solution of all the SQL problems which is present in lead code in this series. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe it so that you will get a notification or you will get to see all the videos of SQL if you are interested. Okay. So let's start this question and see what this question is saying. So the question title is customer who never, got, who never order. Okay. So here we have uh, two tables, customer and order. So customer table has ID and name columns, name column and orders table is, uh, is having ID and customer ID column. So here in customer table, we have an ID column, which is a primary key column for this table. And each row of this table indicates the ID and name of the customer. So what will happen? This will tell the ID and the name will tell the ID. And in an in order table, uh, ID is the primary key for this column. Okay. And customer ID is a foreign key. Correct. Of the ID from the customer table. So this ID will be present here. It will be present here. Right? Customer ID is present here. Each row of this table indicates the ID of an order. And the ID of the customer who ordered it. And what, what is asked? Uh, write in SQL query to report all customer who never order anything. So, just ne kuch bhi order ne kiya hai, wo customers ke naam we have to print it. So, let's see how it goes. So, for an example, one customer table is given which has a values like I, 1, Joe, 2, Henry, 3, Sam and 4, Max. And another is the uh, orders table which is, uh, I mean, ID and customer ID is present which is 1, 3, 2, 1. So if you can see here, जो customer present नहीं है, ठीक है, order table में, so which customer is not C, ये जो ID है, this is same as the this ID, because this ID is is a foreign key for this table, correct? देखो यहाँ पे लिखा हुआ है, customer ID is a foreign key of the ID from the customer table, right? So what happens? This three is same as this so Sam is present. Sam has order something because this is the order table, right? In order table, only those customer is present who has order something. So if you can see here, three is already present. Three is already present. It means it has order something, and one is also present. Present one means Joe. Joe also has order something, but Henry and Max hasn't uh, orders anything yet right so we have to print this henry and max name in our output let's see the output is henry and max right so how we can write the query let's see it so first what i do i will use a left joint right so i will use uh, i will write here select then what we have to print we have to print the name name as uh, customers right so from customer tables so I will make it C. Now I have to do a left join. Why? Why can't we do an inner join? See, if we do an inner join, then what will happen? Only matching records will come. Right? Matching record means 3 and I mean Sam and Joe will come. But we need to print those records which is not present. Right? So what we will do? We will write left join and then here I will use a, another table which is orders and I will make it O on in a on C dot ID is equal to what O dot customer ID right and I will make this C dot right if I run this code you will see all the values. Okay, customers. C O M. Okay, spelling wrong. Now then it again. Again. Okay. Now we have customer. Customer. Okay. Ye small me aayega, so I will make it small. 
customers right and then joe henry sam max everything is printed here but expected output is henry and max so what i will do i will make a condition says where where what okay 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 I will write something like this then you will understand o dot customer id if you are beginner then you will understand easily with the, with the help of this code if i run this then you will see uh, you know for joe sorry for henry and max will get some null values see for max will get some null value and for the for 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 for, for henry also will get some we got some null value why so because these id 2 and 4 is not present in this table right that's why we got null value so what i will write here i will write a condition where o dot customer o dot customer id is null is null or is not null Achha, null wali chahiye, right so isko karenge delete and then we will run it Upcoming a submit, submit be ho jaga. I hope so. Acha, ye to ho gaya one method, right? This is the one method, first method. Now we'll see the second method, what can be. So, okay, so as he and the See, I told you what we need to print those names which IDs are not present in this table, okay. So, where I will write where uh, c dot orders sorry c dot id not in select customer id from orders table. I hope it will work. Let's see. ये भी रन हो गया सबमिट करते हैं ये भी पास हो गया ओके तो देखो यार आई होप आपको ये वीडियो समझ मतलब ये सॉल्यूशन समझ में आया होगा एक क्वेश्चन के बहुत से सॉल्यूशन हो सकते हैं मैंने आपको दो सॉल्यूशन बताए हैं अभी मैंने लेफ्ट ज्वाइन किया था आप राइट ज्वाइन से भी कर सकते थे इसको ठीक है तो सॉल्यूशन बहुत से हो सकते हैं वो होता है कि चलो माइंड में मेरे ये ये दो सॉल्यूशंस आए तो मैंने लिख दिया ठीक है आप मे बी आप एक्सेप्ट भी लगा सकते हो मे बी आई एम नॉट श्योर एक्सेप्ट लगा सकते हो कि नहीं लगा सकते हो बहुत से तरीके हो सकते हैं तो अलग अलग मेथड देखो और ये देखो कि कितनी जल्दी जल्दी रन हो रहा है ओके बिकॉज एफिशियंसी इज आवर प्योरिटी राइट सो आई होप यू हैव लाइक दैट वीडियो इफ यू डू डू सब्सक्राइब एंड शेयर